guys currently off of the airplane and we are officially in Vienna Austria currently in the tram station we decided to buy tickets for the cat the city airport train however I don't think that this is the cheapest way to get to the city it might be the most comfortable and the fastest way but since it's our first day and I wanted to catch the tram or the train as fast as possible I just bought this one but I'm sure I'll find out what's a better the best way to travel to like the city from the airport and I'll let you guys know but yeah we're here we're waiting for the train to come and then we're on our way to our Airbnb um, so far Vienna is beautiful it's a lot colder here than it was in Istanbul or Jordan, all of those places. So now we have to get to wearing jackets, sweaters, scarves. Sorry, the train just passed by. And yeah, I'm excited to be here. It's my first time here. I don't know what to expect, but I'm very excited. Uh, we're currently just waiting for the train to come. It's supposed to come in like 10 minutes. Let me show you what I'm looking at. That's my bag. This is a station. So far, I really like Vienna. You know, it's funny. One of the things that I always look for in a place that I arrive to, I instantly really enjoy it when they have Wi-Fi at the airport. If they have Wi-Fi, free Wi-Fi at the airport, and I don't have to like pay for it or download some crazy thing, I just think it's amazing. Because obviously, when you arrive in a different place that you're unfamiliar with, it's very useful to have internet just so that you can find things out and you know vienna definitely is looking good because there's free wi-fi so yeah very happy about that okay you guys we have made it into our airbnb in vienna i am so happy to be home. I'm so happy with this Airbnb. I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna give you guys a tour. Let's go. This is the entryway. Here there's like a little closet thing at the very entrance. And this is where we put our shoes, right at the front. This is one bedroom. There's towels and soap and everything. Just really cute. And then we have a big bathroom. This is where we can shower. There's a big tub. There's also a laundry machine. And wow, this place is so clean. Look at this sink right here. And then there's this separate toilet area little mini sink. Look at this nice big hallway. We have a kitchen, which is really nice. In Vienna, I kept finding Airbnbs that were pretty small, so like studios, so to have like this spacious of a kitchen is really nice. I love it here. Then we have this window that overlooks the front. And then we have this like view of the street. It's really nice and quiet here. Oh, I love it so much. And then this is like the living room area. There's a couch that I think pulls out to make a bed. There's like big closets, a desk area there. The only thing that it doesn't have, which I'm just now noticing, is I don't think there's a TV. I don't typically watch a ton of TV, but it would have been nice to have a TV, I guess but it's really cute. There's another table here, little lights. 
Here's like another window. I think we're just gonna get settled in here for tonight. I have to finish up some work. So I think this is gonna be the end of vlogging for the day. Tomorrow we will be going to an opera here in Vienna. So I will bring you guys along for that. Hi guys, it is our first official day in Vienna. Well, we got here yesterday, but this is like our first full day here in Vienna. And we're doing something kind of exciting. We are going to an opera at the Vienna State Opera House, which I think is very, very famous. So that's where we're gonna be going tonight. We have tickets and the opera starts at 7 p.m. So we're gonna go on the train right now and then we're gonna get there pretty soon. All right, let's go. Okay, we just left the theater. It was very, very beautiful. Definitely, if you come to Vienna, you must come to the theater and you must, ah, you must watch something, whether it's an orchestra or an opera or something like that because the people were so talented. They were very, very good. The orchestra was really, really good. It was beautiful. And just being in there, the theater in and of itself is gorgeous. It's absolutely stunning and yeah it was amazing so highly recommend 10 out of 10 experience now we're kind of right in front of the theater the theater is right behind us and we're just gonna walk around see what's around here already this is our first night out and I'm in love with Vienna it's absolutely beautiful the people here are very very nice very very friendly very very helpful everything is very clean there's great public transportation from our Airbnb we literally just had to take the train like one stop and we made it here so public transportation is amazing and the buildings and the things that you see are just beautiful everything is nice everything subway stations are nice bus stations are nice 
everything is nice. I love Vienna. I absolutely love it. So far, I'm in love. Anyways, let's go explore. I'll show you what we see because I'm already looking at something beautiful. from basically just walking around Vienna. We did a big loop around the city center and basically just kind of saw the different buildings that there are. We didn't go inside of any of the buildings or go into any museum, but we wanted to just take some time to see the city. And we ended our night with something very traditional to Austria, to this area, which is schnitzel. So this is what we have here and I'm gonna taste it for the first time. I think it's just like breaded chicken. I don't know if it's chicken or pork, but I think it's chicken. It's amazing, 10 out of 10. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give me a like, subscribe to the channel, leave me a comment letting me know what you think about Vienna, Austria, any of those things I would love to hear. And thank you again so much for watching. I hope that you guys have a great day and I will see you in the next one. Bye.